The main challenge today in the world is the energy production and storage. So if we can succeed to tackle these challenges through material science, uh, we, we are moving then uh, steps uh, forwards in improving the world. Assalamu alaikum. I am Ihsan Qasim, a PhD student at MSN department in UM6P, and I am passionate of material science and chemistry. So I will give, for example, um, the example that we can, uh, through material science, design biodegradable coatings, which are eco-friendly and extracted from renewable sources, and apply them on fertilizers in order to enhance their efficiency and to improve uh, the nutrition of the plant. And this is important in sustainable agriculture. These coatings actually, when applied on the surface of granular fertilizers, they are acting like physical barrier that reduce one of the problems of conventional fertilizers, which is the rapid dissolution. So if we can throw this coating material uh, reduce the release of nutrients, uh, it means that the plant can uh, benefit uh, and can absorb these nutrients for longer period and this means increasing the longevity of the fertilizer and this is important in uh, sustainable agriculture and for wise management of fertilizers. Well, I think that um, uh, through material science we can uh, uh, we can tackle several uh, challenges, uh, such as, for example, designing biodegradable materials to replace uh, plastics and petro-based materials, uh, for example, uh, converting the sunlight into electricity, um, uh, valorizing uh, byproducts from mining, such as phosphate, uh, for its use in, in uh, construction materials or in electrochemical energy uh, storage. Thank you.